Yo guys, what's up and welcome to another tutorial. Today I'm going to show you all the best 20 Connect Banks for this year, for 2023. The chance to make bad samples with these Connect Banks is like zero. So yeah, make sure to watch the video till the end because I got some serious sauce in here. And if you want some more accents, perk loops, rises and stuff like that for your samples, make sure to check the description because there you will find my newest multi kit, which is called Cap Package, which includes all of that and even some melody starters and some samples from me. And if you want to get on my weekly sample list, make sure to check the description as well. I just got the Beatsas Pro page so y'all can subscribe to that and get one free kit a month so y'all don't miss out on that use code lucadiff 15 for the discount on the kit and thank y'all for going so crazy on the last top 20 contact banks video we had almost 30k views i think and at almost 1.5k likes if i'm not mistaken and yeah guys let's go now so for the first contact bank we have the grandeur which is i would say the best piano bank for contact and you can change the sound right here when you switch it to soft or to hard close the lid or have it open you can even change the dynamic range and the resonances and the pedal and this is the best contact bank if you want to make dark samples and I use this bank for almost every piano sample I made and by the way I'm going to use some effects for all those sounds just to make them banks and instruments sound even better but those aren't many effects it's basically just a simple reverb then this soothe to get out some frequencies and just this EQ which you can see is pretty simple as well so it doesn't really change the sound too much and for the first pattern I have this MIDI for my friend Flex on the track and I randomized the velocities just to make it sound more realistic he's drummed it already and the finished pattern is sounding like this So then for the second bank, I have the Vintage Organs Bank, which is a perfect bank just to layer pianos or even to make top lines with an organ. And you have a lot of presets in here and even some variations in the one preset I picked. And as you can see right here, and I will play the pattern just for a second and then switch the presets while it plays. But for this example, I'll pick the 12th preset and it's the same MIDI, but the pattern now is sounding like this. Then for the next thing we have the Westwood Lost Piano Bank which is a perfect bank for making dark samples and ambient samples and if you click on the detune tape right here which is the basic preset I think you have a lot of different sounds and a lot of different presets to pick from and as I said this is a perfect bank to replicate like a vintage piano and it just sounds so so good and I will choose the default preset just to showcase it to y'all and this is a pattern from Rizzo Prod y'all make sure to check all these prods out in the description and the finished pattern is sounding like this. But just for the sake of this video, I will show you all another preset and you can click on this randomizer preset and it gives you all a random preset and I will just do that so y'all can hear that it's really a fire bang. Then for the next thing I have the Mellow Flux Bank which has a lot of presets as well. It's obviously just a mallet or bell bank but it has so nice sounds and y'all probably already know this bank but you have a lot of settings you can change right here. Like let's say I want the DK to be lower I can just change it right here and I can even put on a reverse setting so it changes up the sound completely and first of all I got this pattern again with the Mellow Flux on it now with the Celesta and I just tweaked the inbuilt reverb a bit and I randomized the velocities and the finished Mellow Flux pattern is sounding like this. And if you add some portal or some other effects to it, it will sound perfect for dark samples and even for happy samples you can make movie scores with it and all type of stuff. Then for the next thing I have the Ambertone Friedlander Violin which has four presets to choose from which is the sustains, the Cato, Pizzicato I think that's how you pronounce it and the tremolo preset and you can even change up the vibrato and the vibrato style right here. You can solo it, have some settings right here and I will use the Pizzicato preset right here just because it fits to the pattern I have. I just added these triplet notes right here but it's nothing special and the finished pattern is something like this. Then 
And for the next bank, I have the Session Hounds Pro Bank. And if you know me, you know I love this bank. And it's a perfect bank to make like these Gunna, YSL, Young Thug trumpet samples. And even Wheezy trumpet samples then obviously. And you have a lot of different presets to pick from. How the trumpet might sound. And I'll use the Winter Chance preset because for me it's the best one. And I just love to use it. And the pattern I have laid down might sound familiar to you. Because I broke down the sample I made to this pattern a few weeks ago. But it's perfect to showcase this bank. And the pattern is sounding like this. And you can even make top lines with this bank. It's just a perfect bank to make these ethnic type of samples. Then for the next thing, I got the Ratos Audio Ethnic Series Xiao Bank. And it's a bank from a friend, but I really, really use that bank. And it's not just to showcase it to y'all. And this bank has many different options. You can just either pick from the instrument, and then you have a legato, staccato, and vibrato preset. Then for the phrases, you have a short and long phrases preset. And it's tempo synced. The phrases are in A minor, and the pattern was in G minor. So I pitch it down by two right here. And I turn off the delay and played a bit with the reverb, just to make it sound perfect and I came up with this melody and first of all the pattern sounds like this But now we'll turn on the Lost Piano Bank and I will showcase it to you with the bank so it sounds more full and you can get a hang of it how it sounds when it's finished. Then for the next bank, we got the Winter Chance Bank from Big Fish Audio. And I used the Trumpet Open preset, but you have a lot of different presets to pick from. And a lot of different instruments as well, like you have in flute, you have in saxophone and stuff like that. And obviously a trumpet, I use this open preset as I said. You have a mute preset too, so it sounds different for every single instrument. And I just copied the pattern from the Session Ons Bank, and the finished pattern is sounding like this. And you even have a lot of different articulations. Like, let's say I put it on the A note right here, as you can see. It will sound different than when I have it on, like, the A sharp or the B note. Now I have it on the A note, and it sounds like this. And as you can hear, you have a lot of different options with this preset alone, so it's 100% worth getting. And now, for the next bank, I have one of my favorite banks at the moment, which is the D Orchestra Complete Bank. And as you can see, I have just a default preset on here right now, and it's called Strings Basic, and it's basically just like an ARP, but you can have solo sounds in here as well. It has so, so many sounds, and all of these sound good. And I just laid down this pretty simple pattern, randomized the velocities, not even two minutes to make this pattern. And obviously, you can change it up as well. But first of all, I'll play out this pattern, and then after that, I will show you all things that you can do with this bank to make like just crazy orchestral things but first of all the pattern is sounding like this So then what I want to show y'all is when you click on here and then go to animated orchestra, you have a lot of different things to choose from. Like you have four full pages of these. And let's just say I go to page three and pick like a random preset, which is the Merciless Fellow preset right here. And I will just play it and it will sound good. I guarantee that. And it sounds like this. Okay, now let's pick a different one. Let's pick just like the juncture preset. And this one sounds like this. So yeah, as you can hear, it sounds amazing and you have so, so many different presets and sounds to choose from. So this one is 100% worth getting as well. Then for the next bank, we have the Noir Felt Bank, which is pretty known, I would say, but it's still one of the best piano banks for contact, in my opinion. And as you can see, you have a lot of presets right here, like for grand piano, for particles, for sound design and vintage. So you have a lot of different options to choose from. And I used the Flex on the Track Piano again, left it how it was. I think I pitched it up, I'm not sure though. And the piano is sounding like this.
Then for the next thing, we got Atmo World 6, and Atmo World 6 has so, so many instruments. I would say it has about 200 instruments, and I mean different instruments, not just presets, I mean actual different instruments. And for the example, I used this Shanghai Baby Piano Low and White, and I just left it how it was, I didn't change any of the settings, and it's the Rizzo MIDI again, and it sounds like this. Then for the next thing, we got the Giant, which is a perfect piano. If you want like a different sounding piano, I would say, but it's still so fire, even for emotional samples, as you will hear in a second. And you have a lot of different options to change the piano sound. I just left it on its default settings to showcase it. And the Giant is sounding like this. Then for the next thing, we got the Spitfire Audio Hans Zimmer strings. And those are some perfect strings if you just want like an ambient, background, stringy type of vibe. And I left it on its default settings again and laid down this pattern. And the finish pattern is something like this. And as you will hear, it has a lot of reverb on it. But just to layer something, it sounds amazing. And it sounds like this. Then for the next bank, we have The Gentleman, which you probably have seen if you're watching my videos, because it's such a good piano, and as you can see, it has the same settings as The Giant, but it has a different sound to it and a different tone. I left it on its default settings again just to showcase it, and this is the dark piano pattern from Rizzo, so y'all have a difference between an emotional and a dark piano, and The Gentleman is sounding like this. Then for the next thing, we got the Master Brass Trumpets from Audict, and I chose this staccato option right here, I changed nothing else, and I had this pattern again, and it's a very good bank if you want like a different bank to the Session Ons Pro Bank, and the finished pattern with the Master Brass Trumpets is sounding like this. Then for the next contact bank, we have the Passion Flute Bank, which is the perfect flute for almost every type of sample. I just made this pattern to an emotional sample, but you can use it for ethnic guitar or trumpet type of samples as well. And it sounds good in the lower pitch, in the higher pitch, as you will hear right now. And I have this pattern, and I will turn on the Giant Piano, just so you can hear how it sounds on a full pattern. And the Passion Flute and the Giant are sounding like this. And after that, we have the Chris Hines solo violin, where I don't think I have to explain very much. It's basically just a violin, which has a beautiful sound to it though. And I have the same pattern that I had on the flute, and I will leave the giant on as well. And the violin pattern with the giant is sounding like this. Then for the next thing, we have the Olaf Arnold's Composer Toolkit, which many of y'all will probably know. It's a perfect bank for dark samples, for ethnic samples, and for emotional samples. And I'll, pre and I'll showcase it with an emotional MIDI, as I said, from Flex on the Track. And I just left it on a default mix preset, I didn't change anything else. And the finished pattern is sounding like this. Then for the second last thing, which is still so fire though, is the Spitfire Drama Toolkit, which has a lot of different presets. As you can see right here, you can choose between like tremolo, sustain, uh, staccato if I'm not mistaken as well. And you have a lot of different presets in this. I chose the synth pads preset and I chose the synth pads preset and layered the piano with it, the giant again. And you will hear a big difference between the giant not layered and the giant layered. So this is the giant and the Spitfire Drama Toolkit layered. And then for the last bank, which is one of my favorite flute banks, is the Ambertone Recorders bank. And I chose the soprano long setting and laid down this pattern again to the giant. And this is one of five different settings with the flute and the giant together. So 
So yeah guys, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to leave a like and to subscribe to my channel. Please make sure to check out my kits and my weekly samples in the description. I would really appreciate that. Use code LUCADIT15 for 15% discount on all my kits. And if you haven't already, please make sure to activate the bell so y'all will get a notification every time I upload. That would really, really help me. And make sure to follow my Instagram as well if you want to be up to date about everything I do. And thank you all for this crazy support on the last Contact Banks video. And yeah guys, see y'all.